weather boosted Phoebus, y'all. Oh my god! Weather boosted. It's very crappy CP, but you never know. It could have really good IVs, so we're still gonna get excited about it because I never see these anymore. Oh my gosh. Yes! Weather boosted Phoebus, please have good IVs. Please, 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 please have good IVs. No, it's awful. Oh well, it's still uh, six candies. I guess I'll take it. And what do you know, you guys? A weather boosted low tad literally right next to the Phoebus. And there's actually a weather boosted Whelmer over there, too. So, guys, play in the rainy weather. Make sure you get some waterproof uh, cases for your phones. But go out and play in the rainy weather because this is awesome. I officially love playing in the rain these days. Oh my gosh, please have good IVs. I have the candies, just I don't have a good IV low tad yet. Oh my gosh! It's actually pretty good IVs. Uh, not the best CP, but I'm going to keep it because I might end up evolving that later. So that is a very sick catch. And here we are, guys. Literally, that was like the best triple spawn I've ever seen. Oh my god, I'm so lit right now. And I just missed. Wow, that was my last Ultra Ball. <laughs> but guys, um, I have like 330 candies, I think, for Wellmer. So I'm getting closer to getting my first Well Lord. I caught a really good Wellmer yesterday that I'm pretty sure it's going to be the one that I'm going to evolve. So I'm pretty much just um, candy farming Wellmers at this point. But we got it with a pineapple berry. Let's do an appraisal really quick because this is a weather boosted. Okay, decent IVs, but not, not as good as the one I caught yesterday. So we're going to transfer it. Wild Grove Isle, you guys. This is actually a really rare spawn, um, to my knowledge at least. Um, I've seen one Wild Grove Isle before, but that was... Uh, on a sunny day. The fact that this is rainy weather and I still found a wild grove all is pretty insane. So hopefully we can catch this guy. I think he looks super cool in this game, you guys. He is one of the coolest uh, starters in my opinion. I think the Trico Grove All set tall line is probably my favorite in Gen 3. Look how freaking sick he is, you guys. And decent CP too. I mean, 901 is not bad in the wild. And um, I have two good septiles already, but if this guy has good IVs, I mean, he'd definitely be a candidate for evolution because that CP is pretty good. Okay, so we did have to use the golden rads because the raspberries were not working for some reason, but I have plenty of golden rads, so I'm not really worried about it. IV check. Come on. Okay, decent, decent. Okay, that's actually not bad, guys. We might keep it and evolve it later. I'm not sure exactly. You know what, YOLO, guys? Let's evolve it right now. Oh, no, guys. Okay, okay. I almost panicked, y'all. I thought that it gave me the evolution glitch. If you guys don't know about this evolution glitch yet, um, it's basically like sometimes as soon as you catch a Pokemon, if you try to evolve it, like as soon as you caught it, it skips the animation and you don't get to see it. So I almost panicked a little bit there, you guys. But it worked. We got our septile, 1565. Not the best CP. I have one way better, but honestly, guys, I think it's pretty sick. So, yeah, thank you guys for watching.